Hi guys. Thanks to users pushing me, right? I do things. But theming and rising, that's actually entire, entirely up to you. And we give you an operating system with a file, a config for BSPWM, awesome, cute file. But then it's up to you to make this better. And somebody was asking, Eric, can you make a new i3, right? I said, what's wrong with it? i3 is great. And the thing is, it is up to you to have these what ifs. And it's actually not me having a what if, it's somebody else who had a what if on Telegram. So here it is, maybe something for you. Why not combine in open box polybar of left WM? So he asked me in open box, there's at the top menu, which is tin two. And it says, I want, I want to remove that one. So, okay, just remove tin two, the configuration or don't launch it or just remove the app, right? So it was his idea to combine bits and pieces of left WM in open box, which resulted in a combination of two things, right? Somebody saying, why not make i3 nice? was nice my opinion of course right and the combination of these two guys his what if and his question resulted in this and you've been looking all this time at the screen saying Eric this is left WM no right it's i3 so whatever you want to whatever desktop you're on and it's using polybar you can grab code from anywhere on the on the internet in this case this is the db nemesis look this is the polybar from left wm and you know we have like 20 or 23 24 i don't know all themes all different the polybars you can apply them to any of our tiling window managers but that's up to you right i've just made one example and the next video, I'll explain technically how it's done, right? But this is i3. So how do, if you want this, if you say, oh, I wanna, wanna have a look, right? i3, pseudo pacman minus s, and then we have Arcolinux. I gave it a new name, i3wm, and referring to the left wm name. Because we have 20 like these, I could, could make 20, I'm not gonna make 20, not at all, right? But this is the left WM DVD Nemesis, take a, took, take a good look of, took a good look at the polybar config, mashed them all together, and I've got myself the, exactly the same look, exactly the same look as on left WM DB Nemesis, right? So this is the code. And you know where it's going to go, the code, the code is going to go in etc scale config i3. So if you have already an i3, then make sure you copy paste it, right? Make sure you do control C, control V and make a copy, rename it like I've renamed it old and working and keep copies around. Because the code, the new code for DB Nemesis, eh, is actually in here. All we need is this folder, control C, and then you go to your config. This one is gone, is renamed old or working or something else, right? And you copy paste it in here. Polybar is installed, fonts are installed in the package build of DB Nemesis. I have told it, it needs this, 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 right? All the packages that it requires will be installed if you install the package and then you have can have a look like this you have here the menu that's up here change background better close this one change background which is nice not only is it nice if you have a terminal open it follows the color of the background so change background with python pywall I can launch all kinds of applications that I always use. And the workspaces are up here. So if I went to uh, Super F, uh, Super 2, not F2, Super 2, I'm here, right? Super 3, it's gonna be GIMP, I don't know, Chrome, Chromium, right? Super 4, 4 and 5, 4, 
nodal terminal and super fine. So as long as it's filled, it keeps open and it's going to add up. Now I am showing all this right on a dual screen. So I've told in i3 that the 125 goes on this one and DPO is going to be 6 to 10. And you do all that, you know the drill, outlinksd.com, then the menu i3, learn everything you can know about i3 via tutorials, right? We are a university, but it's up to you to study. It's up to you to learn what does it all mean, these lines. I've cleaned it a little bit up, so there are only 754 lines in this package of Arclinx i3 WM DB Nemesis Git. That's the long name. So take a look at the config. The polybar has been meshed also together from the pieces from left WM, the pieces from um, we have that we have in polybar itself, right? So it's not using. That's an important thing. It's not using the polybar, right? As similar as left WM, who says I'm going to keep the polar bar close to me per theme. I've done exactly the same thing here. Same reasoning that i3, this package, has its own poly bar, its own configuration, it owns its own launch and its own scripts. Right? So it's in that folder that everything is available and a few backgrounds to play around with. Right? And a PyCam to have transparency. That's in a shortcut what I've done, what's important to know. And the next video is technical more, right? Is having a look at the differences and all that. All right, cheers. Oh, yeah, have fun.